Hello everybody, I'm back for well, the final part of this uh, Montgomery Where I Grew Up series. Uh, it's going to be added to the impromptu Neptahet Neptus musical uh, presentation. I felt that I really needed to do this to heal, to backtrack and see uh, where I became who I am. Uh, learning that most of it was all set up and designed to disempower us and keep us unaware of who we are, which is monstrous soul chaos beings uh, on this planet. Uh, it has been known and prophesied that we would rise again. And we're understanding that some people were aware of that and they were fast at work keeping us from the knowledge of who we are. Here is Jefferson Davis High School. We were 4A, we had a great football team. We had many people involved in activities at this school back then in the late 70s and 80s. I was very much a part of that. Uh, in high school, I just so happened playing French horn to have overthrown the ninth grader who was first chair, who came on to this school. But by the time I got here, she had left and gone to Lee High School because I was coming here to make a statement without even knowing it as a young man. I was to be the first black term major ever at this school. I should have gotten it in my 11th grade. The members of the band will be honest about that. But I think change is just slow when it comes to these racial relations uh, kinds of things. But here at Jeff Davis is where I studied Latin when everyone else was taking Spanish and French. I had no idea at the time about our ancient history as Etruscans emerging out of Kemet. I knew very little, if anything, about Kemet. At that time, all I knew was in a few textbooks there were pictures of pyramids, not having any idea that we existed all over this planet. The power of the third eye as we held uh, when we were a high spiritual being we built those structures all over the world mainly concerned about getting out of this illusion we now understand the divine mother never wanted us here she was tricked in this volley play of spiritual warfare and Prometheus thank God for Prometheus Prometheus stole fire from Zeus and gave it to humans and for that reason, we have the melanin in us, which is making us higher beings than Zeus himself and those other entities that most people who go to church every day praise and give their energy to without even realizing it. But the Divine Mother is raging back in. She is restoring balance, my art, and justice to this planet. She has come back for her children, which is us. And she's coming in with a vengeance. So, you might as well get in the flow of that and begin to trust yourself and begin to have the courage to speak up and speak out about all the horrific things that are happening to our people. Again, these psychopathic killer elite are aware of who we are and they have been at work all along doing everything they can to stop our rise. But I got news for them. That's never going to happen. We are here. We are back. And I'm happy to be a part of that. Thank you so much from uh, Jeff Davis High School. And all these institutions and colleges, may you all fall in favor of truth. And that part involves acknowledging our ancestors. We are the progenitors of culture and civilization on this planet. And nothing is going to go right until that is acknowledged. Have a good day. I am Dr. Damien Q. Laster, Kabir Amin Ra, Anpua Sarset, Rakti, the Conscious Dr. Rainbow Warrior. Ah, Tum Ra, Metaphysical Science, the Science of Our Ancestors. Goodbye.